Boxer's build. And, you know, by extension, Tasia's build. But I'm pretty sure Boxer came up with it. Boxer makes good builds. He's he's made a lot of the of the builds that Terrans use these days. Yeah, I mean, basically any TVT1 base that has a Hellion or a Reaper in it, uh, in numbers greater than one, is uh, probably a Boxer build. Like, I mean, they call him the Build Master Terran, or like, whatever, some Korean nickname for old guy who does build orders. It's so true. Yeah, I think they, they, they call him, like, the Build Order, so it works out in Korean, it doesn't sound right in English, but they've, they've said it a few times in transfer interviews. Translated interviews, I don't know how you transfer. A tree got through the hardest part was the TVT. His TVT is, like, really bad. He said he lost every single game on ladder today, TVT. Mm. Oh, no way. Yeah. I mean, that that seems like his go-to. This seems like his go-to build. Um, that's, Metalopolis seems like a pretty good map for it. I, I peek through uh, Kodak's builds pre-game. The first game, Shattered Temple's a Blink Stalker all-in. second game was One Gate Expo into Fast Colossus. So, um, so I, I don't know. It, uh, it depends what a uh, tree does. Is he going to hide the barracks? <laughs> yeah. No, he's oh, just, yeah. he always scouts and then puts it down in the center. It's, just like standard that. on. Yeah, I like I like players that have that scouting just like so automatic. Nani was a player like that. Nani would just scouts everywhere always. I think it's such a it's so good. It was Mr. Bitter was talking about that at home story where it's like the difference between like high masters player and tournament player is scouting. Oh it's yeah, like, dude, I, a tree and lock were playing all the time. We thought freaking a tree was map hacking because he made a reaper. He didn't. He never saw the probe go home, so he scouted everywhere until he found it. And he found the DT shrine. Yeah, I did the oh, same wow. thing lock today. I, I totally ninja his probe. He was trying to hide it from me. I was like, nah, dude, obviously you have a probe on the map. I'm going to check until I find it. Yeah. It's just, it, it's really having the presence of mind later in the game to, like, keep allocating APM and attention to scouting. That's when it gets difficult, you know? Yeah. It's like the 15-minute yeah. mark, and you're like, all right, I need to make sure he doesn't have a base. Like, I need to check everywhere and, like, just keeping that APM up. Yeah, a tree, when yeah. he plays me, he hides three bases all over the map. <laughs> oh, oh, here was... I'm just going to insert a random factoid that someone told me that I thought was genius. We got a two racks opening coming out of the tree. He's going to put reactor tech lab on, by the way. Going up against... I don't know what this build is yet. It could either be the stalker sentry 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 one gate, which is really bad and would die, so it's probably going to be two gate robo. Anyways, when you're scouting and you see building buildings with either your observer or your stalker or your probe or what have you... A great way to help you process that information is to try to click on every building, even if you already know what it is. Like, even if it's a built barracks or something, just clicking every individual building forces you to process the information so you can make better decisions. That's actually true. That's something that I like to do sometimes. Yeah, I was... I At think, least that I used to <laughs> like to do. Uh, I think I heard Last Shadow, he was in Korea. Uh, whoever was giving look, Last Shadow... Look, advice, look, 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 look. The tree knows. He knows. Did he see it? No, he knows the scout. Three oh, gate, stargate. Oh, wait. Oh, he didn't see it yet. He's scouting he's everywhere. Like, he knows. He's gonna find it. Rallied down there. He needs to have it rallied down. You need to check. It's, this is the most likely proxy location. He needs to check here. This he will. He will. It's not rallied down there. Is it? Not yet. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, he's gonna get it. Ooh. Yeah. You have to check down here. It's the most likely. Spot. It's you the fastest have... reinforce. There it is. Wow. Tree is so oh, ghosty. Yeah. You can't proxy anything versus a tree. He knows. Yeah. PVT, this is, uh. Yeah. Yeah. yeah of course, he found it. Yeah. PVT, anyone who's listening who dies to this crap, that you always check this spot. This is the 100% most likely proxy location. And then the next most likely one is this ledge that's like. Southwest of where the Stargate is right now, the ledge way down here is the next okay, most likely on either side of the brush. Which, if you notice, for the three places a tree scouted. Here comes yeah. the fuck you for proxying force. Is he gonna get out for the void ray? Yeah, it's dead. Oh, he's not gonna get unless out. he kills a stalker. Target down the void ray! Oh! He have any marines. Oh, yeah, he does. Never mind. He has a good amount of marines. Yeah, I can't see. That's fine. My eyes don't he's work. Got, he's got I think marines he's still fine. Yeah, he's yeah. gonna be pretty okay. Yeah, just back fair. those marines up. Don't, oh, well, I guess you can fight there if you want to. Uh, yeah, I mean, these three marines with two more popping in. I don't need, he's gonna get, like, I don't know, one SCV kill. 
maybe. Yeah, he's gonna try to range him against the ledge, so that's really his only option. Okay, so let's go back to the Protoss base after that, uh... Of course, you would commentate on the Protoss base. <laughs> Alright, so we got three <laughs> gates. Uh, I think gonna he's gonna comment. try and do three-gate three pressure with that proxy power and with the Void Ray harassing. With the one uh, health Void Ray harassing. Yeah, I mean, he's not gonna be able to warp in on the high ground. GG, he's The lock is harassing you, Travel. I see that as more insulting to Protoss than to me. Mm. Yeah. Alright, so look, he's gonna try to hit this warp in right here. No, he's not. He's gonna try to focus the depot. Just lower the depot. This isn't gonna him. work. It's easy peasy. Yeah, okay, so Protoss is gonna try to expand, but... I'm he has no tap. I'm pretty sure Tyron can just go kill him. I guess he's gonna wait for Stim and a medevac. No? He's not getting meta. Yeah, okay, that's what I was gonna think. Yeah, he's just gonna wait for Stim and I guess two medevacs, but there's really no way Protoss can make up his army disadvantage, I don't think. I don't think. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think, but I don't, I don't think so. Mm. Yeah, this, this Void Ray is gonna try its darndest, but just can't. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like these two marines can handle that, it's fine. I'll just put two marines in the middle of the room. Things hurt enough. Yeah. Yeah. Not, not a lot to say about this, I mean, this is... Yeah, I mean, okay, so we got the robo coming up now for the Protoss, but, I mean, this three-gate robo picture should be, like, completed at the seven-minute mark or so. He's well, just buying time with this Void Ray. Just build a turret. Yeah, but he's not actually buying time because the tree's not trying to move out yet, so it's not really it's not really being a pin right now, it's kinda of just being a scout. You know what I mean? Like if he wanted to move out and the Void Raver's pinning, that would be scary. Yeah. Why is he send he's like, I'm just gonna send two freaking two marines. He just it's cool, the put, Marauder's gonna get it. Yeah, he just needs to put two marines in the mineral line. Not there. Not not on the edge, because they'll get ranged. Uh, I don't know if I like that. It's fine. So yeah, he's gonna have two medevacs, one medevac and stim, that's really fine. He picked up the getting hurt one. Oh, there's the two medevacs, that's what I thought. Alright, so yeah, he's gonna go wait till four medevacs to go. I guess that's... Uh, I mean, Protoss is getting a decent army now. And a tree does not have a base. Meds are out, meds are out. Yeah. Well, I'm pretty sure a tree's got this. He just needs to attack Good night, and end it. I don't know, I'm still casting, I'll let you know. This okay, is where push to I... talk comes in handy. Oh, oh but he's doing it! <laughs> he's bringing the house! Oh, he's going for the kills, or... Oh, man. Too many SUVs at home, I don't think you need 15 at home still. No, you really don't, as Heron. Okay. The observer so... sees it. I bet this guy is panicking now. Okay, so let's see. Army supply. A tree has a 13 army lead. In addition, he has stim medvax. Bazillion workers. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Yeah. It, it's it's pros. <laughs> this is so funny. There's some pretty good force oh. fields for the Terran because all the units are on the other side of the force fields. Oh my okay, god! Don't look get that. greedy. Don't get greedy. Don't get greedy. Take the free base and go back. He's, he's just gonna kill him, he's not gonna go back, he just brought all his SCVs. I don't know, I think I think you just go back here. Like, just extend the game, you know? Like, you know? Like, yeah, you probably have a 90% chance of winning right here, but why not just go back and make it 100? Because of all the SCVs that he brought and died. He's still, like, even worker counts, still yeah, one dude, base, one base. His saturation is actually equal to the Terrans, right, or the Protosses right now. Not, like, sort of? Six of the SCVs? Or with his no, 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 still dude, I'm just 21. saying, like, check, no, no, dude, just check the saturation. Terran's getting less gas, but mineral saturation, they're even. Oh, yeah. Mules, he's ahead, even. Yeah, I mean, Mules for SCVs. But yeah, like, you can't, he's not gonna be able to get up this ramp. No. Uh, and he's gonna lose units here. I now he has to fight. Uh, uh, I mean, he has enough, so it's fine. Gotta guarantee he's wasting sentries. Yeah. And he's still streaming in units, I mean, this is... This is you know, like I said, his saturation, his saturation is fine. Green is too old to grow. What are you talking about? The Protoss only in him. <laughs> Didn't the Protoss that, uh, took out Tang do two all in general? Yeah. 
I'm pretty sure an all-in in response to an all-in is not really like an all-in. It's more like a response. He's got one cent. Oh, never mind. It's just warped in around. I was gonna say, I don't think a tree realizes that he has no force fields until he got those two in. Well, we know this is down to this deciding factor, so. Yeah. yeah. I mean, the thing is, even without force fields, it's still hard to get up this way. Oh, is he gonna get that? Oh, man, he's got so many red stalkers. Yeah. Yeah, any direct engagement. Oh, don't go up the ramp tree. Yeah, don't do that. that not he knows. Work. He's just picking shit off now. The only thing is, he's gonna. Well. Alright, I guess, yeah, I guess even if he mines out, he can just pull out. Exactly. Like, if he makes the Protoss mine out, Protoss is screwed. If he mines out, right? This is a good position overall, no matter what. Sniping the gates can't reinforce as well. Yeah. Yeah, he got the Observer, finally. Oh! Now he knows to load up. He's so smart. Uh, Protoss is kind of waiting for something like that, though. I don't even think he has to do this. I think he's. I think he's getting over eager. If there's stalkers snipe any of this, it's so bad. It, like that half health meta. Oh god, just pull back, dude. Protoss, he knows. knows. He knows. He knows. He knows. Tree knows. Oh. oh, he's trying to bust down, and that got shut down. Oh yeah. Oh, that was bad. He just lost that immortal. That is not good. Oh, that medevac got dropped with half full. I still that think a tree is good. 